Hi Blair, hi Al, or all that glitters 21, and Juicy Star 7 here on YouTube. This is a contest entry for your Louis Vuitton bag full of your favorite makeup picks. I think that this makeup look really represents spring and what it's all about. On one side of my face, I did thunder, lightning, stormy season, and on the other side of my face, I did it in the eyes of a butterfly. So on this side, I kind of just did the stormy season. Um, April, March, and May are kind of the stormy seasons of spring, and um, they're not very fun, you know. You kind of just want to stay inside and watch the thunder and lightning. You don't really want to go out. And I think this is a good representation of what it's all about. I wrote boom up here to represent thunder because I didn't know how to draw thunder. And then on my eyelid, I just did um, a blue and black shadow to represent the sky and how dark and dreary it is outside. It's not bright and fun and sunny. And then in the background, I just did kind of like a gray shadow to represent the streets and just how it looks outside. And then I did bolts of lightning here um, for thunder and lightning. And then the blue dots are blue eyeliner and they represent the rain falling down from the sky. So on this side of my face, I of course used my Coastal Scent 80 eyeshadow color palette. I think that this is a great palette, especially if you're entering contests or just doing fun looks like this one because it's hard to use this palette on an everyday basis since it has so many wild, vibrant colors that, you know, you might not have the courage to wear every day. But for this look, it was great. So, you know, I used like this yellow and kind of like the blues over here, like right there. And, um like the black right there and I think that this was a great palette to use for this um, look I also use the black Ulta automatic eyeliner for this side of my face it's not going to focus but um, and then um, I use the same eyeliner but in blue this one's called teal blue so it's just from Ulta these eyeliners are great and um, they really go on really smoothly. So, I also used the NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil. And this one is just in pots and pans. It's a silver color. It's kind of hard to use again on an everyday basis. I don't use it a lot just because um, I kind of wear neutrals to school since um, I don't really like to wear kind of bright fun colors to school so I don't really wear smoky eyes a lot easier either so this one kind of sits in my collection. Um, a big part of this makeup look again was this brush. It's actually a concealer brush but I use it as an eyeshadow brush every day to use my everyday makeup and I feel like it just really packs on the color the way it's built and I also use this eyeshadow brush. This concealer brush which I use as an eyeshadow brush it's just a smaller one from Bobbi Brown um, I love Bobbi Brown and it's just a concealer brush so I really recommend using this one if you just really want to get up close um, with certain spots of your makeup look then on the other side I did I call it in the eyes of a butterfly so as you can see I outlined uh, free-handed a butterfly and then up here I just did yellow for a sun and I out and I colored in the butterfly white base I used my Costa Sense white concealer quad or camo quad I think they're called and I have mine in light <coughs> and I just used the white to outline and color in the butterfly because I think the colors really pop if you put them on a white base so I just did that and then when I close my eyes you can see an assortment of colors and that represents a rainbow because rainbows are bright and fun and you don't really see a lot of rainbows in the summer at least where I live but they're really pretty to see when you have the opportunity to see one. Um, then I just drew a sailboat and the ocean because where I live the ocean is a big deal so um, when I think of summer, I think of the ocean and 
um, yeah so for this side I kind of use the same thing of course my closest sense maybe eyeshadow color um, and I also use this Milani eye tech liquid eyeliner and this one is really cool it's like an eyeliner but it's a pencil I don't know I love this so that's what I used for <coughs> my eye look. Um, it's kind of ugly, you know, you wouldn't wear it every day. But it really just represents spring and what it's all about. On my lips, I just did a bright pink. Um, and it is actually the Wet n Wild 521A. And it kind of reminds me of a Dazzle Glass from MAC. I believe it's called Fantabulous. I don't really know what the Dazzle Class is called, but it really reminds me. I bought it for my Halloween costume and don't really use it because it's kind of an out there color again like this whole look is. Um, but I think that the lips kind of represent the flowers of spring and the leaves turning. You know, you see the pinks, the greens, the whites, the blues, the reds, um, and all of the fun colors. So this look really just represents spring and the stormy season, the flower season, and the beach season. So yeah, um, I'm going to have at least one or two more looks, I believe. Not as elaborate as this one, but just to really get a, uh, just to really get my point across about spring. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this and have a great rest of your day. Alright, bye.